Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna to be sharing with you my essential Indian spices. These are the spices that I use on a day-to-day -day basis when I'm cooking, and I thought I would fill up my spice container and just share with you all of those spices. Now everyone's spice container is just a little bit different because it depends on what spices they like, but if you would like to see a more in-depth video on how I use all of these spices, you can always check out my second channel and I'll link that down below. But for now, let's fill up this spice box. Okay, so first I'm gonna be using some turmeric. Now, this is my most used spice because it has so many health benefits. It has so much good stuff for you. And not to mention the color is gorgeous. So I use this on all my curries and just anything that I'm cooking. 99% of my dishes has turmeric in it. And if you're low on iron or you need an antiseptic, anti-inflammatory, this is your go-to spice. Okay, so my next spice I use is cashmere red chili powder. Now, this is actually used more for color than anything else. There is a little bit of heat to it, but it's not too spicy as a typical chili powder would be. So if you're trying to just up your spice level a little bit and add some more depth in color with your dishes, you would definitely want to grab this spice. I use this for everything all my dishes they all have that deep red color to it and i get it from using this particular spice in general so i would recommend this to anybody okay so next i have coriander cumin powder and essentially this is used for a more deepened flavor uh, it's kind of an earthy flavor if you will and you can actually make this at home you can just roast whole coriander seeds and cumin seeds in a pan and just dry roast them until they're a little fragrant and brown and then just grind them up and this is essentially what you would end up with sometimes people add cloves in here I just like to do it with coriander and cumin seeds now you can get this readily available which is what I did but yes, this is in all of my curries, all of my vegetable dishes, and it is so good. Okay, next up we have mustard seeds. Now, usually I use mustard seeds when I am tempering my oil. And again, like I said, if you guys wanna see this process more in depth, you can definitely check out my second channel because I have used mustard seeds in there before, and I have tempered my oil with all of these spices. But I use this in a lot of my vegetables and uh, my curries as well. And I also use it in my dal and my lentils. So these are amazing to use. And they don't really have a flavor to it, but we just use it to temper. And again, it does have a lot of amazing health benefits. Okay, and now this is garam masala. And garam masala I use very sparingly. And when I say sparingly, I mean I usually just put about a little pinch in my dishes. It is very warm. It's a very warm spice. But if you put too much of it, it can get really uh, hot. And when I mean hot, I mean like there's just a lot of kick to it, like a heat to it. So you don't want to do that. And also when you are using garam masala, you want to make sure that you're cooking it out properly. So I definitely use this during my tempering of the oil, but it adds such an amazing depth of flavor in your dishes. And I would recommend you all to use this at least once. Okay, now I have some fenugreek seeds, and these are actually really good when you put it in your oil, again, when you're tempering. I put this when I have like my lentils or I'm making like a soupy lentil or something like that. And it's also very, very beneficial health-wise. It has a lot of wonderful benefits for, you know, acid reflux or indigestion or anything of that sort. So I would definitely recommend everybody to put a little bit of fenugreek seeds in their food. And if you're trying to lose weight, this is also a wonderful thing to incorporate into your life. All right, and the very last thing I like to add are these cumin seeds. And these are the whole cumin seeds. And I use this in a lot of my dishes. I temper my oil with it. 
and it just adds another earthy type of a flavor. And this is actually used in vegetables, in curries. You could even use it when you're making like a spicy rice. So I always have this on hand. All right, now let's go ahead and just put everything together. So I'm going to start by putting my turmeric. Then I will add some garam masala. Then I'm going to add my cumin seeds. Now let's add some mustard seeds. Now I will add some chili powder and then the coriander cumin powder and right in the middle I will add the fenugreek seeds. All right, so here is how my spice looks and I'm so excited to start cooking again. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And I will be back with some more videos like this if you like. I hope you guys have a great day. Bye-bye.